good early afternoon. Mm -hmm. we're, <laughs> we're at our staycation. <laughs> and James was none too thrilled at how sunny it is. There we go. I got my shadow right over him. And our rooms, I don't think, ready just yet. Because we got all of our stuff. Look at this workforce right here. Stacked up like crazy. <laughs> That's actual clothes. That's all food and snacks. Checked in. We're pre checked in. Yeah. Alright, so. Yes. Priorities, Sarah says. Priorities. <laughs> we haven't seen it this year. But we're pre checked in. She showed me two options one room that was ready right now, which is like first floor facing the DVC pool, or the room that they have us assigned that they're having housekeeping clean right now. Looks a little higher up facing the best pool in the land. So I said, we'll wait a little bit. We prioritize balcony. Yes, it's huge for us, especially with just a resort relaxing stay. Yeah. Wait a minute. Look at that outfit and that precious face. <laughs> Life couldn't be better. Sarah's showing James the tree up close and personal. While we wait. With it being a four night stay, I think it's worth the wait for the better view and, and location. It's not just a quick one nighter like we've been doing. Look how sweet those two are. What happened? That was the cutest smile. <laughs> Hi, are you so happy to be at the Wilderness Lodge? Guys? It's been two, we spent over two and a half hours in the lobby. Yeah. Waiting for our room. But it was worth it. Show them why. So we came to check in and we only had a, we have a studio booked. And the cast member was like, alright, I have a room ready right now with this view and it was really cool she was able to like pull up photos on her computer of the balconies she doesn't even know we're balcony people and i was like okay and she's like or if you want to wait i can tell housekeeping you're here and we can get you in this room so it's still a studio which we'll show that in a second but look at this balcony view yes first of all props to them for bringing christmas lights yes yes sarah hasn't even seen it yet look at this view i think electrical pageants coming back while we're here because they were just testing it and posting about it coming back soon look oh at this oh my gosh view, i kind of have vertigo up here this is absolutely stunning and incredible and we're getting food from there in a second we have the mobile order ready to go wait look at do you this. guys love it yeah worth the wait look at there's a blow up mickey up there <gasps> yes oh, where did it go the pool is oh you ready to start and unpacking? Some lights. Yeah, I'm gonna eat a put donut. In a, yeah, get your donut, submit the mobile order, yeah. and let's start unpacking. I'm gonna show the room real quick. So we've been we've been doing this together for like three years now. Kinda like five if you've been around for the old channel. We all know I get very overzealous. And when Peter gets overzealous, he points the camera at a lot of things in continuous fashion. So uh that's what happens here. Here goes the room tour. Boom. Boom. You walk in. It looks glorious. Turn to the left. Oh, wait. Sliding door. We got a shower. Walk in shower. That's super cool. Look up the myth about that in the lobby. Beautiful shower. Love it. Pretty basic, but love it. Love it. Never look at yourself in those. Awesome closet. You can hear James squawking away. I love it all kinds of storage we're going to be utilizing a lot because we have so much snackage in that one beautiful patches beautiful baby beautiful wife a little table action beautiful tv this thing is cool it lifts 
Here is all of the snackage and food and everything. I'm about to show you this. This is a fun treat. Got Knob Creek quarter oak and then a normal Knob Creek in here. Sarah's got some monster mangoes, some bitters for my bourbon, snacks for Edmund donuts. I gotta unpack all this deliciousness. Ah, uh, I'm on the verge of tears. It's literally, it's like 60 degrees, maybe even 58, and it's gorgeous. The final secret passage to our food. There's actually an elevator down here through those stone walls. And our room's up there. Look at more Mickey lights and everything. More Mickeys, more lights. Oh. Here's our food. Ooh, I got like a 10 hour smoked pork. I haven't had pulled pork, I don't think. That'll be delicious. I got a parenthesis or quotations burger. <laughs> Do we know if it's impossible I think it's beyond. or beyond? I think it looks it kind of beyondish. Um, but the coleslaw looks fancier. Yeah, and I'm making a dipping station for Sarah. And Necessary. then we're gonna unpack all of our, the absurd amount of things we brought. It's gonna be great. I'm very happy. So I just unpacked, look at this. We got James's books, Sarah's and Peter's books, Christmas books, all that full of our stuff. Who else brings Spud? Sarah. Who else brings Peppermint Kisses in a Spud dish? Charge Central, Mask Central, cool toy. All the goods up there, brought our own mugs and Spud glasses. I'm about to go get some ice to mix Sarah a cranberry spritzer and myself an old fashioned. Da, 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 da. Chips, salsa, kind bars, Milano's, pumpkin pie pop tarts, hot wings, buffalo, Italian roast. Delicious. Oh, check this out. Boom! Stocked. We got milk. We got Canada Dry. We got Pepsi. Almond milk. Thing of apples. Bunch more pop. Bunch of mango local monsters. Port wine cheese, ranch, cranberry. Only thing we haven't done yet is unpacked toiletries, but I'm gonna go get ice and we're gonna take a break and we're gonna relax and hang out. I found the other wipes. All right, because we're here four days and we, it took so long to unpack, now it's time to relax. And we've ditched uh, Home Alone right now. We're on the balcony. We got our drinks. We're gonna hang out here with the bats because there's a bat nearby. <laughs> gonna suck our blood and turn us into vampires. We're gonna enjoy this view. We have a timer set for the candlelight procession on a TV to watch it in its entirety. It's so chilly. It is. We got, we got sweatshirts on. In fact, the candlelight processional and ceremony is one of the oldest and Yay. most beloved traditions We're gonna in watch the, the whole over 65 year history thing. of Disney Parks and Joy to the World is my favorite Christmas song. And that's what it opens with. This is the greatest time ever. We did some FaceTimes, we did some snuggles, we did some hangouts, some relaxing. But we're gonna go adventure through the resort. Yeah, walk around. She's got... Slippers on. Slippers on. Resort living. <laughs> so this is the viewing area on the fifth floor. We gotta come back here during the day. But is the electric flight pageant coming back? Oh my gosh, it looks so much cooler on the camera. There's also another viewing down on the fourth. We just... It's so good. <laughs> they are pumping in the cinnamon scent through this vent. It hit us. Trying to get that cinnamon scent in my mask. So even though Sarah's pretty full, I'm not really super full, but we've kind of come to an... There's people by the fireplace. Oh, we'll to come back. They got two bottles of red, so we can't disturb them. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> we haven't really like discussed it. We've just kind of both acknowledge that it's happening, that we're getting Mickey Premium Bars tonight. And neither of us, like, we both I'm like so paranoid stopped. about stairs here, so just... <laughs> We both stopped being like 100% vegan. And I think it's like, it's a fair assumption to say like, you've been more lenient than I. Yeah. But Especially neither, out out. yes. But neither of us have had Mickey Premium Bars since we went like, vegan in yeah. 2018? No, 2019? No, 2018. 20... 2018. 
It's 2020. It was, it was, but it was more than a full year that we were vegan. But it was like April to oh. a couple months ago. Yeah, so but neither of us have had it since like early 2019. And I think we're gonna have it tonight. All right, I'm trying not to be sentimental, but this is a very big moment in my life to show my firstborn child the guys are at Wilderness Lodge. Now, he's asleep, but it's happening. It's not a geyser, the geyser's on there. This is like a gulch. I think it's a spring. Yeah, maybe it's a spring. So this is Whispering Canyon, and we've decided we're never eating all you can eat here ever again. Well, guess what we decided when we checked in? We're eating all you can eat breakfast. Yeah, but it's different. <laughs> <laughs> it's all you can eat, but it's different. Yeah, but we're not eating the... <laughs> it sounds silly, but it makes sense. <laughs> But we always overdo it. I'm so. eating 100 waffles this weekend. These poor lifeguards are still out here. The pool is open. I literally, we've been here in our room since, what, like 4, 450? Yeah. Nothing to say. Oh, there's two people in the pool. Oh, and it's really it is chilly. Cold. It is if cold. we went in, it had to be like the sun baking down. Yeah, like 1 p.m. We forgot while we were in the gift shop that one of the things we wanted to do was ask about renting. One of the whole reasons we went in the gift shop was to rent some movies. And uh, I don't know if it's for all guests or just DVC members. Usually DVC resorts have a community hall where we can rent DVDs, but I talked to the DVC cast members earlier and they said we can't at the gift shop. Yeah. So we're rushing back. I think Santa Claus. Yeah. If they have it, if they're open still. With four minutes left until the, the store closed. Which they did confirm you have to be a DVC member to yes. rent them. Mm -hmm. Got it. Do you like Mickey? Say you do. Um, Look at those legs. You are strong. Would you like to take a boat to Magic Kingdom? Yes! You love Mickey Mouse? Up to order is one clean diaper, two, a Mickey Mouse pail, and three, a DVD player we had a request to play our rented DVD. Best friends for life. Tricks on us. We rented our Santa Claus DVD. Got to the room, realized there was no DVD player. So we called front desk and said, no problem, we'll bring up a DVD player. It was at that point, troubleshooting, that we realized that the uh, the DVD for Santa Claus seems to be very scratched. So uh, this is the back of the Santa Claus. Your trick was a fallacy. Did anyone else use to I, flush DVDs? I put my clean hand in the disgusting toilet. Oh, it's not disgusting. It's not, yeah. I put my hand in the toilet and I put the DVD in it and I flushed it. <laughs> trying to clean trick. the scratches. <laughs> and has it fixed it? Nope. Are we watching Santa Claus tonight? We can on our phone. Maybe there's something good on free phone. Um, we intended, we were going out for dessert. The that's whole why purpose. We, that's why we left. And then we were like, oh, we forgot the DVD. And we were all worried about the, the DVD. We didn't even get Mickey Premium Bars. And now it's closed. I mean, at least it's not our only night here. Yeah. <laughs> but we, we didn't had gummy worms. <laughs> but so. no Premium Bars. I'm just being honest. I think Mom and Dad might be a little bit more tired than James this evening. Um, Sarah is nursing James. Uh, we're gonna do a little trick of the hospitality trade. If you ever ask for hot water in a hotel, sometimes if they can't give it to you via room service, they'll suggest running just a couple cups of water through your coffee maker with no coffee in it. I'm gonna do that to actually heat up a bottle of previously supplied milk for James before we go to bed. But our night is coming to an end, which is funny because it's only, it's before midnight. Like we're rounding down the night, getting ready for bed before midnight, which usually this is like two or three in the morning, but that's part of staycation. It's just relaxing. And tomorrow I feel like we're gonna have a good, long, adventurous slash relaxing day. I'm very excited. It's 
I'm just very happy and grateful for these four days. Before we sign off, I just wanted to show you this ridiculousness. It is currently 48 degrees in our balcony. And at 6 a.m., which is a projected time of wake up, it's 43. And at 7 a.m., it's supposed to be 41. It's supposed to be 41 degrees in the morning. That's insane for Florida. It's only supposed to be get to four, 61 degrees at 4 p.m. What is this? Christmas time. To find me. To Stinky Pete. <laughs> We've been watching like the, the new classic Mickey cartoons all it's evening. It's like the least repetitive of all the Disney channels. Now that Stacy's gone. This is the third resort we've been to where Stacy's not existent. Yeah. yeah. Let's not talk about it. Well, somebody actually that we know commented on her post and asked <laughs> us and she was hopeful that she'd be back. So. But is she in charge? I don't know, but she might know more than we do. Well. Alrighty. Let's hit the hay. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. Should we tell them where we're going tomorrow? Yeah. Magic Kingdom. Yeah. During the daytime. When you've been driven absolutely bonkers by your parents. You just sit and reflect at the end of the night. This is your face. Let's go night night. <laughs> We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.